Nance. McCollum looking for some day late, gets it to Jones, he'll fire, splash, and we are tied. Yeah, that was a great set out of that timeout. Use Brandon Ingram as a decoy and let CJ be the one to initiate the offense. Gilgis Alexander poked away and he coughs it up. Here comes Ingram, full head of steam, extends, and he's put the Pelicans back in front. Spiroditas, Greg Anthony, Stephanie Reddy, rest of our TNT crew. What a fascinating final three and a half minutes this is going to be here in Oklahoma City. Number one seeded Thunder. Can they rise to the moment? Turnover again. Gilgis Alexander. Trying to get it to Dort, threw it into the bench. Well, he, he's dealing with elite level defense. When you talk about Herb Jones and what he's able to do, he's strong and he's long, and he's having an impact on SGA. Pelicans on a 9-1 run. This is going to be an illegal pick. Willie Green's Pelicans, most wins in a season in 15 years. 49 wins, number one road team in the league this season. And we are inside at three minutes. Here's Holmgren on the box, spinning fade. Too much, Nance skies for the rebound. Shea Gilgis Alexander, catch and shoot three. Boy, misses badly. Jones knocked away, Holmgren. And then it's poked back. Who touched it last? Neither official can make the call, and Tony Brothers says jump. Yeah, so they do charge the Thunder with a timeout. So they're okay. down to their final timeout left. What a massive call that is, potentially. Nance rolling to the cup. Broke it up inside. What a defensive recovery in tight by the Thunder. Oklahoma City, youngest number one seed in NBA playoff history. How do they handle this moment? Dort. Misses Point Blank. Wow, both teams miss a Point Blank opportunity. Two Final two minutes in regulation. Jones is fouled. Now that you got Williams on McCollum, let's see if they initiate with him. First in the last two minutes against the Thunder. Ingram leads into Dort, and this is going to be an offensive foul. That, that was a, a little surprising. Not that Brandon Ingram isn't a terrific offensive player. I felt like he has a little bit more of an advantage offensively because of that matchup. Look at the drought for the Thunder. No field goals in more than five minutes. Gilgis Alexander, money on the table, and he buries it. We are tied with 90 seconds on the clock. Oh, that big time finish there. Nance into the corner. This is Jones left open. In and out. Offensive rebound. Nance McCollum misses badly. Jones keeps it alive. What a play by Jones. Aaron pass, loose ball, Murphy. Ingram rises way too much, and it's Nance again. Shot clock did not reset. Ray's got two timeouts, doesn't elect to take one here. Interesting. And here we go, it's McCollum. Pick and roll action, Nance. Inside, extends Holmgren, turns him back. Fifth block for the rookie sensation, Holmgren. And it's Williams against McCollum. Gilgis Alexander, guarded by McCollum. Chisels into the paint, flicks it up and in, and contact. Well, you got to put your team on your back, and that's exactly what Gilgis Alexander has done. What do the Pels turn here in dire need of a bucket? Here comes McCollum. Baseline fade, and he buries it. What advantage. a shot by McCollum, one point game. Yeah, and the advantage for the Pelicans, they have a timeout to give. 
Dort gets it to Holmgren in the corner. About a two-second difference shot to game clock. 21-year-old Chet Holmgren in his NBA playoff debut. One of two. It's a two-point lead. Ingram, five of 17. C.J. McCollum, nine of 21. And here we go. Jones the inbounds to McCollum. Ten seconds. Pelicans are out of timeouts. McCollum against Wallace, poked away. Four seconds. McCollum, the fake, the fire. No, and it's over.